All right, looking to start a new game, Pumpkin Jack. Bought this. I think I like this style of game. Um, I bought it a while ago, and just haven't uh, found a reason to start yet. Um, I put on. I went through the options. I put on ray tracing. Please work. All right, that's all I've really done. I haven't even gone to the skins yet. Time Jack. Now do that. Level select. One, two, three, four, five, six. Set. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, only six levels. Alright! Oh, if this game is choppy, it's gonna be because I have ray tracing on. Um, I think it's an ARPG. But uh, let's find out. I like spooky Halloween theme stuff. So yeah, let's go. Once upon a time, in the great Arkansas Kingdom, <clears throat> the world lived in peace and coexistence. Between the humans, the animals, the birds, even the cute little bunny rabbits. It was an age of prosperity without anything to fear of war, famine, catastrophe. It was so very... Let's say boring. Boring. So boring, in fact, <laughs> that even the devil himself was bored brainless. The devil dreamed of bloodshed, pestilence, suffering on a cosmic scale. So, he devised a plan to make things in Arkansas a little more entertaining. The devil unleashed the curse of the eternal night. A powerful spell that conjured mindless, soulless, heartless monsters across the world. The monsters lay waste to every city, like every home, every leaky outhouse, and backwater town in the kingdom. It was beautiful, but for some reason, the humans quite enjoyed their safe, boring little lives. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They couldn't handle it. a few pesky monsters coming in and tearing them all limb from limb. So, they called upon the champion. The mighty wizard. A sorcerer with the skill and intellect to break the curse and usurp the devil's power. The wizard departed his luxurious tower in his study Smarter to find the, the power he needed to break the curse of the eternal night. Very well, the devil said. Two can play that game. Yeah, and who knows, this might be the fun I've been looking for. So in response to the wizard's quest, he called upon a champion of his own. Stingy Jack, <laughs> history's greatest trickster and con artist, banished to wander the world as a wayward spirit. The devil crammed <laughs> Jack's soul into the skin of a pumpkin and made him a deal. The devil would forgive Jack's past misdeeds and grant him passage to the afterlife. And in return, he gave Jack one simple mission. Find the wizard. And destroy him. It's a two-parter. Finding and destroying. So we're a pumpkin head. I assume killing humans? Alright. Oh my gosh, the open worldness of this all. Okay, I gotta dodge. Okay, and nothing else. Are you something I can do anything with? No. Oh, I can't even go in the water? That's definitely a thing. Got it? Oh my gosh. That, okay. Yeah, 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 just resume. I'm trying to skip this. It's a pretty game. I don't know if my computer can handle the ray tracing yet. I'm not great with frame rate unless it's really bad. All right, whatever. I'll follow the path. Okay. Mm, 
Yep. It's a jumping puzzle. Not a sneaky mission. What kind of wizard can't the devil, yeah, do this himself? Okay. So A is climb and jump. B is roll. But I want to talk. Why would the water be right there? Oh, I see why the water's right there. Okay, probably for collectibles. Okay, let's talk. Show up. I trust you haven't already lost your brain in the uh -huh. gourd. Grown men have died for less than that bird. Tardy and insubordinate. Not an amazing first impression, Jack. Who are you? How do I know your name? Servant of the devil, and I'm here to monitor your work. The devil hasn't forgotten your penchant, penchant for any trickery. Jack, he does not trust you. Just don't slow me down. I haven't forgotten how to roast a chicken. Remember who gave you that fancy new body? Speaking of which, let's begin with your orientation. What kind of fool do you take me for? The kind who spent centuries incorporeal. Now let's stop dawdling. It's time to get acquainted with your new form. Um, okay, bird. I know how to roll. And I know how to get secret presents that I can... Oh, miss pretty easily. One of five spooky presents. I still can't get in this water that's right there. I should cheat engine my way into it if I ever try cheat engine. Um, do I get to use this? No. It's for other people. Yeah, this looks good. This looks good. Why mm. is the drink from these collagen primordials to hold your new body together? Really? Like. Okay, so another Y button. And since I haven't lost any health, I don't think it... Just give me a new gourd! Bingo bango, new head! Wouldn't that be a better way to do it? I didn't know I could double jump. Why didn't I even... I should have even... tried that years ago. Get up there! Okay, there's the map. Okay, 20 of them. I will probably not be finding 20 of those. I'll probably be finding like eight. I get it, double jump, get up there. Maybe I don't get it. All right. Oh yeah, look at that. They have little thingamadoos that show you where you should be. I don't know if I want to cross that yet. What if I want to go down there? Yeah. No. <gasps> Oh my god. Okay. No, shoot. Okay, well there's one that's gone forever. <laughs> I jumped too far. Uh, and already time to move on. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, birds. I wonder if you take fall damage. Ah, it is a little framey. I'm gonna turn off ray tracing. That should really be all I need. Um, wait. Uh, go all the way to the very bottom. Apply. And we're back. Just gotta think for a second. Ah, yeah. It's pretty smooth now. Yeah. And honestly, I cannot tell the difference. Get a running. St Why do you need a running start? Boop. No one needs a running start, fools. Hey, birdie. Not bad. Not bad so far. You've shaken off those cobwebs well. It does feel good to have my own body again, arms, legs, and everything. I wonder what everything is. You really put them. The test from here, there will be monsters ahead. I shouldn't have any trouble fighting them off, but I've never been wondering on chance to bash some heads in. Why should they attack me? Yeah, right? Oh my gosh. Okay. So I will I won't be attacking humans. I can barely tell each other apart, let alone something like you. Oh, but it or not. You're still human. That alone makes you a target. And is someone who can think like a man. Come on. 
The most dangerous prey of all. Man. I see, and he doesn't mind that I'm cutting down his monsters. They're practically worthless. Do what you must to get the job done. Being told that you're practically worthless. Man. Um. Okay. So, whoa, 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 whoa. I saw a beat. Oh, that's just the one on the wall. Okay, and that's obviously the way that I just came. So what if I just skip it? Right? <laughs> right. Yeah, I'm sorry I didn't roll through your dumb puzzle. Um, you gave me the option, and uh, I took it. Like, why would that even? Why would that choice even be there? Uh, all right, all right, all right. We're good. We're good. Oh, now you're gonna make me. I guess now when I actually have to use that ability, I will have no idea the timing. And it'll be a pain. It's back, flap away, everyone flap your lives, with more birds. I need through before I pluck you all. Scarecrow, I've got craw claws on how to use them. A common scarecrow, I'm Jack, the greatest rogue ever to live. He's got legs. Scarecrows don't have legs, head isn't even stuffed with straw. Now let me through your COVID creeps, is that what I heard? Red? Not so fast, seems the birds have the upper hand for once. We'll let, we'll let you through, Mr. Jack, if you help us in return. What do you want? A scarecrow often appears with Arnold's head, he's been terrorizing us for weeks. Um, okay. We are gonna go take on a scarecrow. And have this bird that likes to chill on the head. Scarecrow King. king. Uh, this kind of reminds me of a, oh, LB. What is that? Oh, LB. Oh wait, that's not my weapon. I, I just got a node. For no good reason. Dancing to me. Just need to see him dab, and we're good to go. All right, we just keep doing this. All right, I get it. <laughs> the hell? The gramophone. Gramophone. Well, I found another. There's like, so far, there's three types of secrets. Old timey music that you dance to, uh, and skulls and presents. I keep hitting right bumper when I need to hit left bumper, so that's probably not gonna go well. Yeah, I haven't hit yet. All right, so I think you can only use your little birdie pal at certain spots. Boom. Got whatever that was. Mm, boom, got him. Uh, boom, got him. Oops, ah! Oh. Gimme? I'm a little bummed I'm not gonna get them all now, because, like, what if. Uh, get it? Okay. Okay, okay. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Whoa. Okay, I have a spin attack. That's, that seems alright. Uh, can I run fast? Can I charge? I can, I, know I can do that. Boom. Hit it again. I thought I already got this. Oh, yeah, yeah. It says I already got it. Maybe for future playthroughs. Alright, boom, boom, boom. What if I jump attack? Boom. Got it. Leave that one there to scare the other planks of the in place. Okay, no. I hope those I hope that isn't like currency I have to collect. 
We will see. All right. Boop. I often wonder if double jump is a useful feature because, I don't know, whenever it was first introduced in NES age, NES age it was rare. Uh, like, Mario did double, didn't double jump for a while. I don't think he even double jumped in Mario 3. Um, I don't know when he started double jump. I should probably kill this guy with my stick. Boom, 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 boom. Ah, uh, you're a coward. But, I don't know. Probably bad at, yeah, yeah, fire burns. Okay, I guess that stays on fire. Um, but then everything started to become a, a double jump. Like, you, you never just have a single jump. Oh, F! I got hit for the first time. Oh, maybe second? Second if you... What's the point of me hitting that thing with the... With the stupid crow man? If, uh... Ooh, what's this? Hello! Dude, that guy... I like the artwork here. Yes, I'm not here to hurt you. You look like a monster. Rod and half dead soulless, of course. I'm a salesman! Ha! Ah! Well, now I just want to kill you anyway. No, 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 stop. At least browse my wares first. Like, what's... He's not wearing anything under his trench coat, and he's just flashing you. Harvest the skins of interesting dead people for other people to wear. Close to. Uh, please take a look. Well, this is what we did. I'm gonna stick with the pumpkin. I guess I could just buy this. Yeah, I'll get one. How much is the most expensive one? 40! Guess what we're saving up for? Probably that one. Okay, good. I'm still wearing my, own, my, my, my the OG skin. Uh, nothing back here. So anyway, double jumping. When everyone started doing it, it it's... Like, what's the point? I, I guess... How they d decided it adds pleasure to the jump mechanic? Oh, it does just restore health. Okay, good. Thank goodness. Well, I'm not going to open these things up. Um, but I'm happy to maybe give you more fine-tuning with your jump. But just get better with... Oh, my God. Just get better with your one jump. I mean, I'm not great at video games at all. But... I don't know. I think it's an overused mechanic. That's barely a mechanic to begin with. Um, boop! I do like this... Oh, oh. <laughs> He's super slow attacking things. I don't, I don't even have to dodge from. Uh, oh. You dirtbag! Help! Ah! Ah! Mr. Crowman's looking to me, so I gotta take it. Um, yeah, I mean, I guess it feels cool to like sometimes do a long jump like that versus boop, boop, you know, a quick one. But yeah, maybe just have a length of press hold for a jump. You know, have a baby jump, a big jump, stuff like that. Because, I mean, I get it. Games like this are platformers. This is not at all what I thought it was going to be. I thought this was, this was going to be like, this was going to be a Diablo-esque. Uh-oh. And this instead... Alright. Oh, crap. Is... Ah, crap. Ah! I'm so bad at video games. Okay, single jumps all the way. Um... No! Okay. Thank oh my gosh. I'm a golden god. Okay. I'm gonna guess no fall jump for a dead man. 
or full damage, fall damage. No fall damage. I like the level layout. I, I think this might, I don't, is this built for kids? Yeah, okay, bye. It's very cartoony, which the cartoony aesthetic works. And I kind of wish I would have played this during Halloween. I think with only six levels, I don't want to hold off and try to play this again. I'm going to try to get whatever things I can just in case I do try to play it again. Because I forget games pretty quickly. Um, and if I come back to this, it would be nice to have a leg up. Okay. Get the range ones. Get out of the way. Yeah, this is a really easy <laughs> dodge. A few times I've been hit is just me being impatient. Wow, you can kill him with that. I thought it would just stun the big boys. Alright, I think I did everything back there. It's time four out of five for the presents. It would be nice to, to get all the presents. Um, yeah. That's about it. All right, birdie man. Back to your new body. Is it needed here? Hop out for a minute and look inside. Hop out of your body. Of course, your new body's just a shell. You can always use your head. Ho, ho, ho. Get out of that thing? That's disgusting. Cram it, bird. Hop to it, Jack. Drop your body and head inside. Um, I wonder if you just do it here. I assume Y button? Yep, Y button. Okay. All right, I've got some roots, some roots, and uh, a little variation on the platforming. This is all right. I got. I have to do a friggin'. Okay. I guess. So okay. Uh, yeah. And here we smack that. Well, I still have to get up more. Oh, I see. Oh, I double see. Okay. <laughs> Alright, fine. You got me, game. I don't think I can make that. Oh, I did. <clears throat> Platforming King. Definitely. It has good controls. Open sesame. I always wanted to read the Arabian Nights. It's trapped. Okay, I got an achievement crash. Boondakut. Um, I don't get it. Uh. I was thinking about playing the new Crash Bandicoot game, actually, pretty recently. Uh, it looks like, I assume all the others have never played a Crash game, but, you know, that can be fun. I like a light story sometimes, you know, just relax and play a game. Just, just don't worry about it too much. I wonder if this is the way I'm supposed to go. Anyway, Arabian Nights. Uh, it's one of the few, uh, I, things I have in my Kindle. Um, and I've read parts of it. Like, I think old books, I, and, you know, this is probably a crappy way to think, but old stuff's old, new stuff's better. Old books are hard to get through. Just the, the pacing of stories that are old is slow and and difficult to, to, to get through. Um... Newer things, just much better pace for like what we're used to for our times. They're they're contemporary, right? And I, I tried to watch Casablanca, I think, or I don't know, some noir style uh, detective thing, whatever the Maltese Falcon, maybe. I don't know. Anyway, some old black and white thing, and it was just so slow. Okay, just get get the spawn. 
Um, please get the sign. There you go. Um, and it, it was just so slow and full of so many things that were very predictable and I've seen in other movies but I, I guess those old movies and the old classics um, are where all the contemporary like that's, that's where the things came from the predictable cliche things that's that's where they originated and people say like that's what makes them good you can see where it started but just because like hey Ford made like the Model T is the first one, but does that mean it's good? I'd rather have a friggin' Tesla. Or, you know, the, the newest generation Toyota, whatever. Um, I am lost beyond belief. Oh, I've already spawned. And, you know, new stuff's better. Innovation. It's what we do. Double jump. I gotta click save, throw my little buddy dad away. All right. I think my favorite old movie, uh, if you want to, like, black and white old, is, uh, you know, I'm not gonna say Wizard of Oz, which I haven't really watched since I was a kid. Um, I have watched as an adult. Please, let me get in there. Got that oh, sh. What? <laughs> Um, give me a body? What now? Merry Christmas, that man. In case you hadn't noticed, I'm dead these days. My annex with the devil have resulted in me being stuck here in a way as a wayward spirit. For all eternity, I won't bore you the details of how I'm writing the letter right now. Yeah. This year I've been dead. I haven't been able to pull any prank scams, scamming old ladies, or pick by any drunks on the way out of the tavern. Short, I've been bad so it must have been good in exchange my lack of bad deeds ask for one simple thing give me a body since jack no milk and cookies for you this year as we've already established i'm dead and uh okay so we get some backstory for getting all the presents got it um oh my gosh all right i'm gonna let those guys show right there I am being lazy and bad. Oh crap! Am I gonna die? Friggin'! I have to throw a bird at it. I don't think I can hit it. Maybe I just didn't hit it enough. Um, Twelve Angry Men. Favorite old, favorite old movie. It was even all right when Polly Shore did it in the '90s. Um, called <laughs> remade it and. Telling of jury duty was was not the worst. Oh my gosh! Yeah, then set myself on fire. Oh shoot! It's gonna spread. I hope it doesn't spread too far or too fast because I like to slowly explore it. No, okay, good. It's not spreading. Um, I feel like that's just plain good writing, and you're in a small like. Small cast, don't need a lot of space, and uh, it's, in general, timeless. Um, about a jury who uh, one guy doesn't believe the guy is guilty, and the others uh, think he is. But then he turns the rest of the jury around. Convinces an in th them that an innocent man is innocent. Yeah. Good times. Alright, which way are we gonna go? We are gonna go. Up here! But. You know, with that bias. Oh, crap. Um, yeah, I gotta go this way. Against old stuff? I've, I'm also in this funk where I don't wanna watch a lot, a lot of new stuff either. I, mean, I think I'm like past my time of what I wanna watch. But then I, I watched WandaVision, which I just really thought I'd have this big hatred for. Oh my god. And it was good! It was alright! Oh my friggin' goodness. Did I miss it twice? Oh, I just can't even get up there. It's... I just can't. It's impossible. 
Um, yeah, it, it, it was well paced and uh, you know, meta enough. And there you go, catch up on fire, dummy. Help. And I, I've only seen every Mar I've only seen the Marvel movies like one time each at most. I'm not sure I've seen the Batman movies, but I don't think I have. But the other ones, I've seen them once. I used to try to see. Oh my gosh, this place! I set it on fire too much. Are you happy? You smell smoke. You have a pumpkin head. How do you smell anything? You gotta get the flap out of here, Jack. Yeah, we do. Oh crap! Just gotta go. Who thought dry straw and hay how it could burn so fast? Yeah, haha. I'm gonna be one freaking thing short. One crow mask. mask skull. And I can't really think straight because I'm running for my undead life. And it's a weird camera angle. But I keep trying to keep centered, even though it has auto centering. These are fun style maps. The Master Chief one, in, uh, or you know, that they always have. Like, like the Warthog trying to run away. So this is going to be fun until they're infuriating. Infuri ah, run! How big is this friggin' barn? Is this like a barn castle? Did the Amish make this thing? Are they still making it? Please? There you go. Yeah, you made it. First try. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Don't look back. Do like a like a friggin' boss. Don't you still look back at the. You worked that place. I didn't see that awful scarecrow. What do you mean? We killed so many scarecrows. You're you're a big dumb liar. All right, we'll talk to you, I guess? I guess not, okay. Uh, I wouldn't have drank that otherwise. Uh, move on. Boop. Uh, please? There we go. Can't go up, so we go over. Yeah, this is all right. Um, oh, boss time. Who goes there? Show yourself! There he is! God, just those uh -huh. as always. I'm so creative and it's just a bog standard scarecrow. Did you see me? Please tell me you didn't see me. Oh, look at here. Back for more fun, little birdie? God, he saw me. Uh -huh. Flee, flee. Stop wetting yourself. Yeah, you're on my friggin' head. Oh, that's just gross. There's a big white spot on top of my head. I heard you were skulking around here, Jack. You dimwitted monsters. Not cutting it for the old man, hmm? I'm my own business. And if I, if you don't get out of my way, I won't mind turning you into kindling. Um, all right, Devil has the Goliath and Wayward Souls after it. And uh, well, we'll show him all you humans are good for, living or dead. I'll bury you again, you witch. Um, yeah, okay. What, LB? You LB'd, you dumb bird! Please? Fuck! Alright. Alright, alright, alright. I get it, I get it, I get it. I'm gonna die. I'm not even trying to hide it. Nope! Alright. Okay, now I just run. Now you run. Ah! Okay, it's easy enough. Easy enough. You just don't have to jump. Okay, let me do this again. Boom! Big hit with the. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, it's three times the charm? Yes, it is. Alright. Um. Probably a little more hardcore. 
Definitely. I'll take it. I'll take it. Stingy Jack, the genius trickster <laughs> who could fool even the devil himself, has returned to the mortal realm. Okay. Armed with a brand new body and his soul cruelly bound to a festering pumpkin, Jack has been joined by his stoic guide, the owl, and commandeered the services of a cowardly crow to fight on his behalf. Yeah, it's pooping on his head. But there must be no more time for fun and games. Jack and his companions of the night must embark upon their quest to slay the wizard. With Jack now perfectly attuned to his new vessel, the owl leads him to the mountains in the distance. All right, so we're saying we're at the heart of the mountain, through a network of ancient mines. Tutorial would lies a powerful secret. Okay. 